Hey guys, um, you're not going to believe what I did. <laughs> I'll get to that in a second, but today I am testing out this Timu Dyson dupe. We've had issues. We have had issues. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Okay. And I actually already recorded this video. I messed up the first one. I, I threw this on like super fast. I'm wearing a dirty shirt. I was not planning on filming today. I was editing, editing this hair video. And it was just so such a train wreck. I was messing it up really bad. And then it just dawned on me, I'm using it wrong. I was using it wrong. <laughs> I was using it wrong. So, I think I know how to use it. I'm going to do this again. I'll even show you some of the some of the footage cuz I thought about I almost deleted the whole video like, "Oh man, just forget it. I'm starting over." But I kept it because I'm going to share how ridiculous I am. I want to share that with you. I think we all need to be honest. We all don't need to like practice doing something and get really really good at it and then like show people like hey let's try this out and then like you're amazing at it like come on let's just be real i messed up and i'm gonna show you guys i messed up i messed up there you go roll it All it does is it blows hot air. Am I doing this wrong? It's a blow dryer, that's all it is. Unless I'm doing something completely wrong. So let me put this other one on because technically this is supposed to be like a different direction. to do. You spin it. This thing actually scares me. I don't want to burn my hair. It's actually pulling some of my hair out. This thing is a nightmare. I wouldn't really get this. This thing is ridiculous. I'm not using this. I'm not using this. This is insane. I'm actually going to return this thing. All this is is a blow dryer. It doesn't spin. Isn't it supposed to spin? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'm kind of thinking I'm wrong. It's a weird shaped blow dryer and it's a little frustrating. I don't know. I kind of feel like maybe I'm doing it wrong. Th that's a that's a no for me, I think. Sending it back. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. <laughs> I, I feel your pain after watching that. Like, I feel your pain. This thing can't be that bad. Right? Like, it can't be that bad, girl. Like, you're doing something wrong. Um, we're going to try this again. The only thing that I've noticed, because now I have watched several videos on how to use the Dyson, um, I've noticed on this, there is no cold... Like there's, they, re they recommend like when you're using your Dyson that there, I guess there's like a cold shot or a cold button where you kind of blast it with some cold air to cool your curl before you take this out. So it'll hold better. Um, this does not have it. It does have three settings. So I was playing with that. They are heat settings. So you've got the number one, I could actually just hold it 
while it's going and it never burns my hand. P putting my hands out like this, it actually feels kind of cool. So in all fairness, number one could be your cool shot, okay? But I was playing with the temperatures and I put it on number three, two or three, depending on how hot you want it because three is pretty hot. But either way, depending on you need two or three, if you were to switch to number one for that cool shot, it takes a long time for this to cool down to get to that. You have two directions depending on which way you want your curls to go this way or do you want it to go this way? You just change you know, depending on the arrows on the top. This is like your regular blow dryer part, I believe that's what that is. Um, or you can do these two brushes. So, otherwise, this does feel decent. I'm almost certain the Dyson one probably feels a little bit more heavy duty, but um, I was pleasantly surprised on how nice this did feel. Um, it didn't feel too cheap. I know it could probably feel better. So we'll try it, I'll show you. So some, some of the things I noticed that work better is damp hair, not wet hair. I, I'm starting off with dirty hair, like I've got dirty hair. I washed my hair two days ago. So this is dirty hair. So um, we're just gonna use a water bottle. I got this one too. I haven't decided which one. I think I like this, how this one comes out super fine, but um, this one's adorable, right? It makes it look like I've got issues. Well, we all know. <laughs> so actually there's three videos in one today. This one here where I actually think I have it figured out and we're gonna try it. Then there's the footage that I just showed you where it all went wrong. Um, and then I did another video that I'll put at the end where um, I try that Amazon hair. Do you guys remember those that watch all my videos where I got that, those clip-in hair extensions from Amazon and they're friggin' amazing? Trying them for the first time, um, I did do a little video of um, putting them in my hair and how they look. Anyway, so that's at the end. Um, so if you guys want to stay, you know, after we review this, if you guys want to stay um, towards the end, then I um, try on my Amazon hair. And if you're interested, if you do like that Amazon hair, I'll have it linked below so you guys can click on it and go right to it. But anyway, so let's try this out. So first thing I'm gonna do is um, I'm gonna put a little dry shampoo in my hair because we're talking about two day hair here, like this is, right? Even my bangs look are starting to get a little, like, girl, like do something. But um, I wasn't gonna record today, like I said. I was editing all day today. But anyway. Oh, that came out a lot, my goodness. let that sit a minute. I really think I've got it figured out. I just haven't tried it yet. So maybe this is going to be a failure too. <laughs> Get it in a little bit there. So maybe I'll section off like the top part of my hair here. All right, we're using one of those weird clips to keep like the top part. See, I don't got a lot of hair, like this is all I have. Split in the back and then I just pull it forward. This is just the top of my hair, like there ain't much going on. So hopefully by using this, we can add some body and volume and then I'll look like Farrah Fawcett from the 70s. That's the goal. Right? Okay, so what I saw, I really hope this works. Um, we're just gonna grab um, a little piece. We're gonna start off like small here. I'm gonna brush it out, make sure we don't got any knots. Okay, we're just gonna do this front little section. This might not be a good 
piece because it's not very long. It's just very little, but I just want to try it. Okay, we're going to dampen it. Hair is damp and you've got some of this hair hanging down. Can you guys see like there's just a little bit of hair hanging. What way is it spinning? It's going to spin this way. So I think I hold it right here then and then it should grab it. Is it the wrong way? Maybe it's this way. Oh yeah, okay, I had it the wrong way. But my thing is like, my hair will not hold a curl, like it's not gonna stay. And the fact that we can't do the cold shot, I'm wondering like how well this is gonna work. I'm wondering if I turn the heat up, would I get more? You know what I'll do? Maybe I'll hit it with some hairspray. Let's just hit it with a little bit of hairspray. I'm gonna pull some more of this hair up. You guys are probably like, girl, you are such a mess. My gosh. Let's break this into two chunks. Get it damp. Let's try three. Gosh, that comes out so much. I totally like doused my hair. See, the thing is though, is that when I spray it, it's getting these curls wet. So maybe starting with damp hair might be better versus like spraying them because then they're getting wet. So that might not work. The bigger the chunk, um, it's harder for it to like pull it in but if it's just like a little bit of hair it'll wrap it up but otherwise sometimes I feel like I have to help it through we're just gonna do a smaller chunk this one isn't too big and then I'm just gonna bring it down to a one Okay, that seemed like it worked pretty good. Look at that. So there is like a learning curve to this. That seemed like that worked doing a two to a one and then it didn't take too long for it to cool down. Okay, so that does seem like that works. If you do a two to a one, the only thing with that is that you're exposing your hair to high heat for longer periods of time because I think with the Dyson, it doesn't take very long for it to dry your hair. And then you do that quick cold shot and then you can stop and it's like, I've seen these girls, they do their hair and it's like poof, like they've got this curl. Where this one, it takes like a little bit longer. We've got some curl here. I'm just gonna like leave that be. I'm doing just a little bit of hairspray at the end of each one. Um, I don't know if that's really necessary, but I know my hair will not hold a curl. Okay, so I'll be right back. I'll just, I'm just gonna do the same thing on this side. Okay, so the one thing I am noticing is um, it won't pick up a lot of hair. You can't have too much hair. So I don't know how that compares to a Dyson. Like, will a Dyson pick up a bigger chunk of hair, like a heavier hair? Um, also, I'm, I've kind of played with the heat, like starting on a three and then quickly going to a two and then down to a one. So it's just, there's a learning curve to this, trying to figure that out. So um, then I'll do the top. <sighs> Thought I'd leave that one in a little bit longer just to kind of see. Yeah, like the it's it would be so much better if we could have that cold shot because it takes so long for it to cool down and it doesn't even fully cool down. It gets to like a like a comfortable warm. This one's kind of going flat a little bit. 
We might have to zhuzh that one up. I don't think I did that one very long. I feel like um, Nelly on um, Little House on the Prairie. Y'all know you're thinking it. This little mother. So just to like a little recap while we're letting everything cool before we kind of like bring our, um, you know, ring, put my fingers through it. Um, it's my understanding that the Dyson, you don't have to have your hair in it for very long. So it's not exposed to high heat for very long. I might be wrong, but this does work but it doesn't have that cool shot and i'm not quite sure how much hair the dyson is able to pick up if it's able to pick up heavy hair or not but um if you just have like a little bit of hair just like a thin little layer of hair this thing will pull it right up it just spins it right up it's, it does a pretty good job um but if you have just a little bit too much hair it'll still do it but you have to like help it a little bit and then it, it'll take it right up. Let's see, I think everyone's cool now. Let's see. What do you guys think? It added some nice volume to it and they, they look like soft curls. Thing is, is will it stay? I've heard from people saying that if when they do their curls with the Dyson, um, that they'll have curls for days. Some people's hair will take a curl and it's curled until you wash it again. Like whether you're using a curling iron or you're using a Dyson, that part would be interesting to me because Yes, this curled my hair, and I'm sure a Dyson would curl my hair. A curling iron curls my hair, but within a few hours, my hair will go flat. So it might look good right now. It's 12.30 in the afternoon. But I'm kind of wondering by like 3.30, are we gonna, 2.30, is it gonna start going flat? Okay, just a quick little update with the hair. It's been almost two hours since I did this. I am losing some curl. Um, that's usually, like, look, like, I've got some wave in there. But that's usually, like, what my hair does. Like, I, I just can't get a curl to stay. So, does the Dyson really do that? Like, or is it just I'm doomed? Am I using the wrong products? Maybe there's like a product I need to put in my hair to get the curl to stay. Um, it does work. Um, I would recommend it. Um, I think it's totally worth whether it's, I think what the 30, $35 that I paid for it. Um, so yeah, I do recommend that. Um, it's just, my hair just does this. It just won't keep the curl. It does have a little bit in there. There's still a little bit of a wave, but it's been almost two hours and um, I'm not surprised, but it's just what my hair does. Whatever, anyway. I don't know, there's no hope for me. Whatever, bye. But is there something magical with a Dyson that your hair will not go flat? You're gonna keep that curl. Like, do they put like magical powers in there? And your thing like so anyone out there that says the Dyson they have curls for days but does your hair do that with like a curling iron but I guess like are you able to return the Dyson at Ulta if that's not the case I'm wondering because I know Ulta has like a nice return policy um, usually it's like within 30 days but I know they also have like restrictions on things so um, I'm wondering if I did spend that money on a Dyson and it didn't work like I'm hoping it would, um, could I bring it back? Anyway, I've got more footage coming up here um, about my putting in the Amazon hair where it kind of adds more volume, more length, more everything. And um, it, it was kind of an interesting thing. So make sure you stick around and watch that. See you guys.
so what I want to do for the rest of this video um remember my hair that I picked up from Amazon well it's been sitting in this friggin bag ever since I got it because I want to experience it the first time with you guys so every time I go to get ready I'm like oh it's ready I'm gonna no wait I can't I want to wait because I want to, I don't want to like practice with this and get like really good and then like show you guys like, see, see how easy it is to put it in your hair. I want you guys to be frustrated with me. I want you guys to laugh with me. I want you guys to make fun of me with me. It'll be a good time. But since this hair has got like a wave to it, and if you guys have no idea what I'm talking about, you guys are like, what do you mean, what hair? What are you talking about? What do you mean, what hair? Well, I got this hair on Amazon and I was prepared to make multiple purchases to get the color right. You know, like it matches like perfectly. I gotta go grab something. Can you just wait a second? I gotta go get something. Right? So I turned my little, my little floor fan on. <laughs> but I need it. I'm warm and then I'm gonna be curling my hair and all these lights. It gets warm in here, you guys. Because she's wavy, this is not. I'm gonna, I gotta get some curls going in here. I thought I would try this one. It's hot toddy before ironing. It's meant for like dry hair, like your hair's already dry. Cause a lot of those heat protectant sprays are meant for like damp hair. And my hair's already dry. So I was going through all my hair products and I have a lot of them. I always make sure I don't have lipstick on my teeth. I, there is a video out there of me where I've got lipstick on my teeth. I decided to leave it out there. I could have taken the video down. I kept it up. I noticed ever since I kind of kicked it up a notch with you know getting highlights I never used to get highlights um, as I started to get older I didn't get gray my hair got darker like I used to be like blonde like when I was little my hair was white I think my mom called it a toe head like what does that mean oh yeah Heather she had white hair she was a toe head what the heck does that mean I gotta look it up hold on a second I've been doing that lately I've been like looking it up you know like when it's raining cats and dogs like how did that originate so I looked that up that's kind of interesting but whatever we're not gonna get up you guys aren't gonna hook me into this because I'll sit here and I will talk for hours without doing my hair toe head like t-o-w h-e-a-d toe head like one word it says a person with very light blonde or untidy hair untidy the word comes from the noun toe in the sense of flax which is usually a golden color so since flax is light in color blonde people especially children are sometimes referred to as toe heads or toe headed so weird Anyway, I don't even know. I get sidetracked, so I don't even know what I was talking about before. We're there's a hairspray now. Okay, we're doing hairspray. Okay, so then I do this. Just because my hair will not it, it looks like oh no, your hair holds a curl. No, it doesn't. So then I just like to pin it up with just like a little like bobby pin so until it cools. So I'm just going to go through my hair and curl it and then I'll be back. See like look at that like it holds a curl but just briefly. I'm just going to put my finger down and just kind of put like bring it up to the top and pin it. Alright I'll be right back. Oh and then like curling your hair too like I almost have half this side done going like curling it this way and then like curling one this way and then curl one that way and then curl one this way and it kind of helps give you a little bit more body so we're almost done with this side and then I'm gonna switch to the other side and then now I'm just gonna do this side see I, I don't have much hair like it doesn't take 
much. This is half my hair. Like, there ain't much there. <laughs> I don't know. Hopefully, it'll all come back after a those that don't know, I lost a lot, a lot of hair when I was like ill, but I don't know if she's coming back or not. But anyway, all right, I'll be right back. All right, there we go. We're going to make some coffee. I want to also bring up, and I haven't brought it up in the past like several videos, but my mother has her own etsy account where she makes jewelry she made these earrings and um she also made them for me in silver and then these are gold so she made me these they're just a little like they have the silver accents so i've got those in silver and then these ones in gold So make sure you guys go check out her um, Etsy her Etsy account for very minimum, very very minimum. Like we're we're talking like rock bottom. Just go over and follow her. Like just trying to get her numbers up, and then also go through some of the things that she has on there, where um, you can just heart a few things, just letting her know like what you like. Um, and then also um, the month of October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month, and she has been like making jewelry like crazy and she's got a bunch of ones that are um, breast cancer awareness um, jewelry I think she even has some earrings yeah earrings and bracelets so cute you guys go over and show some support follow like a few things and then maybe make a purchase all her stuff is like crazy affordable super fast shipping like right so go check her out it's my mom this is my mommy. Go say hi. So then I'm just going to pull all these out. Let's pull it out. My hair never holds a curl. Like it might look good like at first. Like oh okay maybe. No. It goes flat so quickly. Alright did we get everybody? And then just kind of shake it out. A little bit of body. It's just like a little. Nothing crazy, but we need to have a little bit in there for when we do this because this has got some wave to it. I, I did consider um, getting this out and practicing um, before I did a video with you guys so then I could show you like, here, here's how to do it. But then I thought, you know, it would be better if you guys just watch me struggle and um, try and figure it out. What's this? This is like a two clip one. This is two clips. Oh, this one's four. Oh boy. And this is three. How are we gonna do this? <laughs> I seriously don't know what I'm doing. What makes sense? Like we gotta hide the clips, right? You're just gonna clip it in. Maybe I need to put it a little higher. So then I'm kind of thinking not a lot. You don't want to like add all these knots to your hair, but just a little bit of back combing. So, cause I'm thinking like if the hair just, it'll slide right out, right? Do we need to put hairspray on it? Do we need to put hairspray on that? Maybe just to kind of help hold that right there. Well, I don't know. We're learning. I don't got to go anywhere. So if it ends up being horrible, that's all right, we're not going nowhere. We got this little comb. I think this comb came with it. If it didn't, it's a nice little comb for it. If it ends up being too long, we might have to like move it up. We want it too close, right? We don't want it like too close here. We want to put it back to hide it, I'm thinking. Clip that in. I suppose if this is too long, I can trim this, right? Trim it, right? Okay, and then put the hair down. Ooh, the only thing is that I love putting my hair behind my ear. So I gotta be careful not to do that. 
Should I put it up a little higher? I'm kind of thinking I should. Let's do that. Let's just put it a little higher. I just worry about, you know, covering it up. I don't want to be able to see the clips. Right there. Back home it just a little bit, just to give that clip something to hang on to. Let me know too, if you guys know about hair extensions, like, is that what you do? Like, I'm not doing a lot. I'm not like adding, not like how we used to do. <laughs> wow. I used to take my bangs, go up, like, like you back home and spray it with your Aquanet and then take your blow dryer and bake that hairspray in. All right, so we gotta go back, so we're not too close. That's good, huh? Oh, look, and then with it being higher, I can put it behind my ear now. And you still can't see it. Right, you can't see. It's like right there. Okay. Oh, so that worked out good, putting it a little higher. Like, here's my hair. Here's that hair. Okay, I like that. That's a little bit better. I like having it a little higher. All right, now let's hit it over here. About right there. Is that it? So the ones that I'm using are the two clip. And then I suppose, like, after a while, too, if they get grubby, you just wash them. Right, with some shampoo and see like this already went flat. Is that all right? Or do you think I would add, maybe add some more curl right there? I've got hair. Oh my gosh, I've got hair. I could even, look, you could even pull it back. I don't think you can see the clips. Can you see the clips? What do you guys think? Honest opinions, like, like don't, you know, like don't be like, oh yeah, Heather, it looks great. Yeah, you keep doing that. It looks great. I'll link this below. It's on Amazon. Um, I think the color I got, I'll put down, I'll put right here the color that I got. Um, but I'll put that down below. They've got different sizes and different colors. Um, and then I th even think it's a 30 day return policy. So if you get it and it's not the right color, you can return it and then try a different color. I got lucky with the first color I picked ended up being my color. Um, so that was kind of cool. But anyway, back to this. Let's get back to this. Look at this, you guys. All right, let's back it up a little bit. Oh, you guys, look at this. I got some more length. I got more volume. I mean, this is just two clips too. Like I could add more. And it doesn't feel like real heavy either. So um, I kind of feel like the placement is right. But if you're like a hair person and you know like how these go in and where you put the first ones, like comment down below, like help me out. Like, is that where you put them or do I have them in the wrong spot? Do I need to put them lower? Um, do I put a, the other, like do I put these up a little higher and then another set lower? Like I'm kind of thinking like, the four would go across the back I'm kind of thinking like maybe I don't know so um I'm just really glad I finally tried it I've been a little nervous about doing it because I thought it was going to be really hard but it's not it's like crazy easy you guys need to check it out and these were so affordable it says if you start to lose the curl you braid them and then it, they, they tell you how to do it, like you braid it and then you you like wrap them in a curl, like in a coil and then you put them in the, the little, the, the bag and then you store them like that. I think going up a little higher, that helps me get my hair behind my ears. All right, let's wrap it up guys. This was so much fun as usual hanging out with you guys and I will see you guys on my next one. Bye.